This video is going to give you an amazing build for every single position in NBA 2K23 My Career. So whether you want to play as a point guard, shooting guard, small forward, power forward or centre, we've got you covered. We'll be going through the physical stats, attributes, badges and takeovers so you'll have everything you need to succeed with each build. So getting straight into things, here are the best builds for every position in NBA 2K23 My Career. The most popular position for most 2K players is point guard and we've gone for a two-way playmaker build. Start by setting your height to 6 foot 3, weight to 220 pounds and wingspan to 7 foot 1. Onto the attributes, for finishing you'll want 55 close shot, 71 driving layup, 50 driving dunk, then 25 standing dunk and post control. Then for shooting, go ahead and set mid range to 65, 3 point to 70 and free throw to 63. Now for the attributes where this build excels, set pass accuracy to 89, ball handle to 91 and speed with ball to 91. The other area where this build stands out is in its defensive capability. For these attributes, set interior defense to 30, perimeter defense to 90, steal to 73, leave block and defensive rebound at 25, then have defensive rebound at 45. For physicals, you need to be quick, so have your speed at 93, acceleration at 88, strength at 40, vertical at 63, then stamina at 90. Now of course, both badges and takeovers are different from next gen to previous gen consoles, so we'll recommend the best ones for both scenarios. For next gen, take the team ratings boost as your primary, then pull up precision as your secondary. For old gen, you'll then want to have playmaker as your primary, then shot creator as your secondary. Now onto the badges, it's also different for next gen and old gen, so we're going to give you both. On next gen, for finishing, go for silver giant slayer and bronze acrobat. Then on old gen, you can keep those two the same and add in fearless finisher bronze as well. Onto shooting, for next gen, have gold clutch shooter, silver space creator and bronze amped. Then on old gen, do the exact same but add on bronze blinders as well. Then for playmaking, you have a lot more options. On next gen, you can have Hall of Fame Ankle Breaker, Hall of Fame Dimer, Gold Floor General, Silver Special Delivery, Silver Hyperdrive, Gold Quick First Step, and Silver Handles for Days. Then for old gen, you can add in a few more. So go for Silver Ankle Breaker, Silver Clamp Breaker, Gold Dimer, Gold Floor General, Silver Handles for Days, Silver Hyperdrive, Silver Killer Combos, Gold Quick First Step, and Silver Special Delivery. Finally, onto defense badges, for next gen you'll want Bronze Menace, Silver Pick Dodger, Bronze Workhorse and Bronze Clamps. For old gen, select Silver Clamps, Bronze Glove, Bronze Interceptor, Silver Menace, Gold Pick Dodger and Silver Workhorse. With this build, you'll be throwing dimes and controlling the court. While you may not be a scoring machine, that's not really your purpose. However, a build that certainly will rack you up some points is our Shooting Guard build. This shooting guard build is a brilliant two-way three-point shot creator. First off, you're going to want to set your height to 6 foot 6, weight to 204 pounds and wingspan to 6 foot 10. This gives you a nice, well-rounded physique that will help with both your shooting and defense attributes. So firstly, for finishing, you'll want close shot at 56 and driving layup at 76, then leave the rest at 25. Shooting will be your most important attribute, so for these you want 77 mid-range shot, 92 three-point shot and 72 free throw. For playmaking, set your pass accuracy to 70, ball handle to 93 and speed with ball to 83. On defense, put interior defense at 34, perimeter defense at 91, steal at 87, block at 25, offensive rebound also at 25 and then defensive rebound to 47. For physicals, you're gonna need a lot of speed, as every elite level shooting guard does. So for speed and acceleration, set them both to 85, then have 74 strength, 57 vertical and 92 stamina. For next gen takeovers, you'll want to go with spot up precision as your primary and limitless range as your secondary. Then for old gen, select spot up shooter as your primary and playmaker as your secondary. For next gen badges, in terms of finishing, go for Bronze Acrobat, Bronze Drop Stepper, Silver Giant Slayer and Silver Pro Touch. Then for old gen, use Bronze Acrobat, Bronze Bully, Silver Giant Slayer and Bronze Slither. Then for the shooting badges, on next gen go with Silver Amped, Silver Slippery Off Ball, Silver Volume Shooter, Catch and Shoot Gold, Corner Specialist Bronze, Space Creator Bronze and Dead Eye Gold. 
On old gen, select Gold Amped, Gold Catch and Shoot, Bronze Corner Specialist, Gold Dead Eye, Silver Limitless Range, Silver Slippery Off Ball, Silver Space Creator, and Gold Volume Shooter. For playmaking, you'll want to focus on badges that increase your ability to get away from defenders and drive into space. So for next gen, go with Gold Ankle Breaker, Bronze Dimer, Hall of Fame Quick First Step, Silver Clamp Breaker, and Silver Handles for Days. Then for old gen, go for Gold Ankle Breaker, Silver Clamp Breaker, Bronze Dimer, Silver Floor General, and Silver Handles for Days. For next gen defense, go with Silver Ankle Braces, Bronze Off Ball Pest, Bronze Menace, Silver Pick Dodger, and Silver Clamps. Then on old gen, select Gold Ankle Braces, Silver Clamps, Silver Glove, Gold Menace, and Silver Off Ball Pest. This build will make you an excellent two-way shooting guard that can both hit threes and play defense. If you want to be your team's main scorer, then I'd highly recommend giving this one a try. For a great small forward build in my career, set your height to 6 foot 7, weight to 210 pounds, and wingspan to 7 foot 1. This will have you playing as a two-way interior finisher. For finishing, go with 83 close shot, 90 driving layup, 90 driving dunk, 60 standing dunk, and leave post control at 25. Then go with 70 mid-range shot, 60 three-point shot, and 73 free throw for your shooting attributes. Your playmaking also needs to be decent, so have 74 pass accuracy, 86 ball handle, and 83 speed with ball. For defense, go ahead and set interior defense to 60, perimeter defense to 90, steal to 82, block to 49, offensive rebound to 27, and defensive rebound to 50. Then finally for physicals, you want to go with 86 speed, 80 acceleration, 78 strength, 87 vertical, and 95 stamina. The next gen takeovers should be finishing moves as your primary and extreme clamps as your secondary, to cover both your offensive and defensive output. Then on old gen, your primary should be slasher and your secondary should be lockdown defender. Moving on to badges, for next gen have Gold Acrobat, Gold Giant Slayer, Silver Aerial Wizard, Silver Fearless Finisher, and Silver Posterizer. Then for old gen have the exact same badges, but bump Fearless Finisher up to Gold. The badges for shooting on next gen are Silver Amped, Gold Clutch Shooter, and Gold Slippery Off Ball. Then on old gen you want the same three badges, but have them all as Silver. You get quite a few upgrade points for playmaking, so on next gen go with Silver Ankle Breaker, Silver Floor General, Bronze Mismatch Expert, Silver Hyperdrive, Gold Quick First Step, and Silver Handles for Days. Then for old gen you'll want the same badges again, but add in Silver Killer Combos. Then finally for defense badges on next gen, select Bronze Ankle Braces, Silver Box Out Beast, Gold Pick Dodger, Bronze Chase Down Artist, and Silver Menace. On old gen, go with Silver Box Out Beast, Silver Challenger, Silver Clamps, Silver Interceptor, and Bronze Menace. Playing as a small forward with this build will have you driving to the rim and finishing a lot, but also protecting your own basket as well. You'll be the perfect blend of an aggressive scorer and a lockdown defender. If you want to play as a two-way stretch glass cleaning power forward, set your height to 6 foot 9, weight to 218 pounds, and wingspan to 7 foot 7. In terms of your attributes, for finishing, set close shot to 67, driving layup to 80, driving dunk to 80, standing dunk to 75, and post control to 50. Then for shooting, have 69 mid-range shot, 81 3, and 69 free throw. Playmaking is a little less important, so have 70 pass accuracy, 60 ball handle, and 50 speed with ball. Defense on the other hand is vital, so set interior defense to 84, perimeter defense to 70, steal to 79, block to 90, offensive rebound to 90, and then defensive rebound all the way up to 99. Then finally for physicals, have 81 speed, 76 acceleration, 82 strength, 70 vertical, and 91 stamina. The two next gen takeover badges should be spot up precision as your primary and see the future as your secondary. Then for old gen, have spot up shooter as your primary and glass cleaner as your secondary. For finishing badges on next gen, you want silver aerial wizard, silver fearless finisher, bronze limitless takeoff, and bronze bully. Then on old gen, go with silver aerial wizard, silver bully, bronze fast twitch, silver fearless finisher, silver limitless takeoff, and bronze posterizer. As for shooting badges on next gen, select Silver Amped, Bronze Claymore, Silver Midi Magician, Gold Space Creator, Gold Volume Shooter, and Bronze Catch and Shoot. For old gen, go with Silver Amped, Bronze Catch and Shoot, Bronze Deadeye, Silver Midi Magician, Gold Space Creator, and Gold Volume Shooter. 
In terms of playmaking badges, you're pretty limited, but on next gen you can go for Bronze Break Starter, Bronze Dimer, Silver Post Playmaker and Silver Vice Grip. Then for old gen you have Bronze Bailout, Bronze Break Starter, Bronze Hyperdrive, Bronze Post Playmaker and Silver Vice Grip. Finally, for defense badges, you have a few, so on next gen, go with Bronze Ankle Braces, Silver Box Out Beast, Silver Post Lockdown, Silver Workhorse, Bronze Chase Down Artist, Silver Anchor, Silver Brick Wall, and Gold Rebound Chaser. Then on old gen, have Silver Anchor, Bronze Ankle Braces, Gold Box Out Beast, Silver Brick Wall, Gold Chase Down Artist, Gold Pogo Stick, Silver Post Lockdown, Gold Rebound Chaser, and Gold Workhorse. This build will have you cleaning up on boards and will also give you the scoring flexibility of getting buckets both in the paint but also acting as a stretch four from the three point line. Playing as a center in my career can be incredibly fun, especially when you try out our inside out glass cleaning stretch five build. Set your height to six foot ten, weight to 239 pounds and wingspan to seven foot five. Then for finishing attributes have 56 close shot, 75 driving layup, 85 driving dunk, 90 standing dunk and 55 post control. In order to be a great stretch 5, you'll need 75 mid range shot, 85 3 and 60 free throw. For playmaking set pass accuracy to 70, ball handle to 35 and speed with ball to 26. On defense you're gonna need to be a rock, so have 82 interior defense, 71 perimeter defense, 70 steal, 88 block, 81 offensive rebound and 99 defensive rebound. Then for physicals go with 76 speed, 70 acceleration, 86 strength, 78 vertical and 90 stamina. Your takeovers on next gen should be see the future as your primary and spot up precision as your secondary. Then for old gen have glass cleaner as your primary and spot up shooter as your secondary. When applying your badges for next gen finishing have silver back down punisher, bronze dream shake, bronze post spin technician, silver aerial wizard, bronze fearless finisher and silver posterizer. Then for old gen have the exact same badges but add on silver rise up and silver fast twitch. Onto shooting for next gen, go with Gold Amped, Bronze Claymore, Gold Volume Shooter, Gold Corner Specialist and Gold Catch and Shoot. Then on old gen have Gold Amped, Silver Catch and Shoot, Bronze Corner Specialist, Silver Deadeye and Gold Volume Shooter. For playmaking on next gen, go for Silver Break Starter and Bronze Vice Grip. Then on old gen, go with Silver Break Starter, Silver Post Playmaker and Bronze Vice Grip. Then finally for defense badges on next gen, select Silver Post Lockdown, Gold Workhorse, Gold Box Out Beast, Bronze Chase Down Artist, Silver Brick Wall and Gold Rebound Chaser. For old gen, have Silver Anchor, Gold Box Out Beast, Silver Brick Wall, Bronze Chase Down Artist, Gold Pogo Stick, Silver Post Lockdown, Gold Rebound Chaser and Gold Workhorse. This center will be an animal in the paint, scooping up a ton of boards and getting a lot of blocks. But on offense you also have the option of playing as a stretch 5 and hitting some 3 point shots, so things should never get boring when using this build. If this video helped you out then make sure to watch the video on screen now as I can almost guarantee that it will help you even more.